Hello everyone. Are you a Mandalorian fan? Do you like Star Wars? Well, if you do, stick right here because you're going to want to see these new diamond paints that I've just got in. We'll be right back. Hi everyone. I'm going to go ahead and open these up. Uh, the latest big craze right now is the Mandalorian, and my daughter loves the Mandalorian. My husband, they all love to watch it. But it's not wanting to come out of its pack. It don't want to be shown. It don't want to see. Okay, here we go. We got it. We got it. So this one is 12 by 16 inch. It's a 12 by 16. It did... This company sent you a little bitty square of wax. I mean, little bitty. It's the size of my uh, middle finger. And here we go. Here's the diamonds. You can see all those pretty color diamonds is in there. We'll go through those. I'm smelling glue. It smells like Elmer's glue. That's different. Usually these things don't smell like Elmer's glue. Anyway, here we go. Grogu. Everybody loves Grogu. That's his name. Spoiler alert. Too late. I've done said his name. If you haven't seen The Mandalorian, the child's real name is Grogu. And we thought this was a really cute picture. He's got his little frog in his hand right there do you see that can you and it's uh, 12 by 16 meaning you really want this to be an up close picture so you can get some detail in it you don't want to it to look like um, you know minecraft <laughs> okay so i have pulled that back the cover it's a ford glue and what's happening here is it's wanting to stick on the other side to the wrong side. Okay, there is a wrong side like I've told everybody. The right side is towards the picture. The wrong side is away from the picture. If you pull that whole film off, just know that if you put, if you put it back on and you put it the wrong side, now I don't know what in the world is going on. If you've put the wrong side down against the glue, it's going to be so hard to pull off, it may pull your glue off. So you, you might want to check, if you can't remember which side is the good side, check with the corner piece on the corner maybe to check to see which one pulls off better. Okay, I never pull it totally off. Never pull it totally off, that way you'll know. You, you won't get mis mixed up. But some people do. They jerk that whole thing off on these little pictures. And you can mess yourself up. And you can see how good that glue has went over there. There's no imperfections or anything. That is a good glue. It's a heavier canvas. Yep, it's a very heavier canvas. Some people like the heavier. Some people don't. I'm just happy if it don't have no rivers in it. Don't have no bubbles and stuff. I don't care how thick the canvas is. If it's if it's in a pristine state with that glue on there, I'm happy. Okay, so I'm gonna try. Okay, and see, I can't ever put it down as good as it came, but I do try as hard as I can. Okay, there we go. Now you can see how much that flattened that side out. Nice because I did check that. And now we're gonna dry this side. Peel that back. And you can see how easy that is to peel back. I'm being very careful. And I peeled it back on itself. There we go. And now we can take a look on this side and you can see there's no, no issues at all. I don't see any bubbles, anything like that, no rivers. You can see the grid. 
and it has 23 colors. 23 colors is pretty good for something that's mostly green. So St. Patty's Day's coming up. Ain't that great? I've got green in, in my fingernails from my color street that I sell. I'll leave that in the description down below and I need to quit hitting that camera so much. The leg of my thing keeps hitting. Okay. So now I'm just going to let that kind of fall down on there. It does it on its own. And there we go. Nice flat. Now I'm going to lay it out probably and let it let it be okay all right oh i've got an air bubble we got to get the air bubble out definitely don't want to leave an air bubble no okay it'll be okay though youngins we'll fix it there we go it is fine and i did get these little storage things that i can put it in let's see if this is too big for this one Hmm. That one's a little bit too small. That's okay. But I won't put it. I'm not gonna put this in the storage thing yet. I did get. I'll leave. I'll leave a link to that with the storage ideas in the description below, so that way you'll understand what I'm talking about. Storage things to put these in. I hate it when it feels like there's lint on your face. All right. Now we're gonna go through the colors of the the drills. 23 colors. Let's find number one. Number one. Success. Number one. Okay, we're going to show it to you backwards. All right. There we go. We've got, this is like a grayish, greenish mint, uh, a, a gray mint. Um, and then there's the peachy pink. It's a uh, 310, I think. That's the blacks. The green, it's a beige green. And a little bit of a tan, uh, not a tan, but a um, light, light peach color, yellow, a darker green, and then there's the, oh my gosh, that is a cream color, it's a pretty color, it's a buttery color, and we've got all of these greens and oh, here's some more of this it's a little bit lighter color than that other mint green it doesn't have as much gray in it okay so yeah we've got all kinds of really nice look at all those different greens and then we have some browns and a little uh, off-white so yeah we've got a lot of really pretty greens in this one. St. Patrick's Day is coming up and it's so appropriate. Like I said, my fingers have uh, shamrocks on them. That time, my little trick of get, putting it up on the desk didn't help. None. And I did it backwards. Don't do this that I just did. You see how I folded them? I folded it in on itself to where I can't see the numbers of the diamond paint. I got it that time and I did it again. I don't want it to cover it up and it's it's turning a different way and that's what's making me mad. Okay, so I got it that time and I did do it the correct way. Let's hope I did it the right way this time. This one is fighting me. It does not want to go back in. It's being a rear. <laughs> this one, let me make sure that it is the right item number, SM295, SM295 on the diamonds. Make sure that that little number on here matches this little item number right here, okay? Make sure you, you match that item number right there. That makes sure that they sent you the correct ones. Okay, now we're going to open up this one. We're going to pull this one right on out. Oh my goodness, what is all this? Well, this is very different. I open it up and we have some loose little baggies. One, two, three, four. We get four, four loose baggies in this one. We get some number, I guess this is little labels. They've sent us some labels. A how-to, little how-to 
and the two. I don't want to lose these little baggies. I don't use the baggies. I usually send them to Jillian. <laughs> I had a, a ton of them. Now, I don't like the static it, it causes. Some people love working out a baggie, so that's fine. Nothing wrong with it. It's just not me. Okay, let's see. I don't remember. B1236. B1235. So let's do this one first. And again, this is all Mandalorian. I noticed they had a lot of Mandalorian different designs to choose from. And these are the ones I picked. I still have some in my cart waiting for later that I may get. Um, this one, I, I just now saw it. I'm hoping that it's going to turn out right. I really am. I, this is really stiff. This is... You can hear it. It's stiff, stiff, stiff. It's stiffer than the other one. And that is the image right there. He's got a profile. And then the front of him. Little Grogu. So there's, there's that image. And what that is, is uh, a 20, 20 colors in this one. And both of these are round. The one before was a round diamond painting. Had round round diamonds. So let's open this. This one does have a lot of wrinkles. It is a poor glue, but you know how these stiff ones, these smaller ones, have the... Uh, there we go. You can see the, the wrinkles. And I think a lot of it, a lot of that is just from the process of putting it on and shipping it folding it up causes it or either they're just really quick bad. but it's it I don't see any really bad problems I can tell this is not as good a quality as that first one it's not as thick glue the other one had a really thick thick sheen of glue on it you could see it there is one little flaw in the glue but it's it's not erased or anything that I don't think it's going to cause a problem to where you can see it after the diamonds are on it. So I don't know if you'll be able to tell where I'm talking about. There's just a little, little imperfection, but it's not going to be bad at all. So it, it looks like it's going to be just fine. It looks like it's a square canvas, but I don't think there's a big rule on, on it. It's a round painting. But it does look, if I, I don't know if y'all want to look at it and see if it looks more like a square canvas to you. The way the grids are set out. These always throw me. When they're squared out like that with the color blocks, it makes me think it's a square. <laughs> it may not even be. It may just be me. You know, um, I'm not, not a pro. No, I'm just a hobbyist. I, I love doing it. I make mistakes and say the wrong things about stuff sometimes, just like anybody else does. I mean, honey, the weatherman used to get it wrong so bad. They had a joke about the one that we grew up with. So I was Charles. Charlie said it would, but yeah. And then they got they gave out umbrellas with that on it but anyway so don't take me as the be all end all of, of diamond painting and crafts and I'm just here to help or share and just have fun with you I do notice is this canvas got glitter in it or is that just a shine hmm it looks like it may have very 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 fine glitter embedded into the canvas and there is Grogu we have two in this set. It did come with a boat. A tiny, tiny thing of what, what hits it with them. They're giving smaller little things a wax, it seems like, now in these. Why would they want to do that? You need it. Well, see, I don't use a wax, so it's not a big deal for me. But if there's somebody else that's heavy-handed like me and they do use the wax, they'll run out of that 
after that meeting in a <laughs> square inch. Okay, oh, there's some pretty colors in this. Remember, there were 20 in this pack. Here's number 20. Look how pretty. Oh, my goodness. We've got some nails at Color Street. That is this color. Oh, I love Color Street. Y'all, I hope y'all can try it. Y'all can hit up my link and go try it out. If you'd like a sample, let me know. Um, it's dry nail polish. You don't have to worry about getting it on everything. Okay, so that was number 20. Here we go. Mint green. Pretty, 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 pretty green. That's a Hulk. I mean, purple. Purple. That is a Hulk purple. This is gray and a black. Let's see all those pretty colors. I hope it was zoomed in on them. So I like to do that and let you see if there's any kind of junk in them. You can see these little pieces that come up. Like right here, that's little, some of them are little pieces of plastic. So this company, has, I don't know yet. We'll have to see if it's as good as some of the others that I usually have. And I think that's two, three tens right there. No, that's not. That's not. That is a different uh, color. That is a dark, 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 dark navy. And then we've got these others. You can see we have some hitchhikers in some of these. <laughs> and this is a really pretty teal color. Okay. That one folded a lot better than the first one. This, is the, this was a two-pack, if you remember. You get two and one, which I think I paid $12 for this. And I got two. So that's like a little over $6 per. And here's another. Right. Let people see. And he's got, I can't remember what that is really. I think that's like lightsabers maybe. I'm not sure. I'll have to go back and look at the pictures and things to see what it what is on it. Another cord glue. These little small ones usually are. Oh, let's not let it flip back over on the wrong side. It wouldn't be good. This will go good with my Boba Fett that if, if I'll ever get done. I give it away to several people, but they leave and forget it. Somebody will grab it up. I just like being generous. If I have extra stuff, I like to, you know, somebody comes to my house and say, here, try this. See if you like it. See how that did? It flipped over and was sticking into that onto the wrong side. This one has 20 colors as well. So both of these have 20 colors. They are full drill. They're not parcels. All three of these are round drills. All three are full drill. There's no parcels in here. I can't stand a partial. I mean, if you're just starting out, get you a partial. See if you like it. If it's just a picture that you just have to have and it's a partial, go for it. Don't let me discourage you at all. Okay, here we go. We got some Kermit the... I wouldn't say that's Kermit the Frog. No, but that's a pretty green, isn't it? That's a really, really, really pretty green. And gray, and then a darker gray. And you can see what color it is. I don't have to tell you every time what color it is, do I? Y'all want dumb. Y'all know your colors. I'm sure y'all went to school. <laughs> And here's some teals. Look at all these pretty teal colors. Just a darker, a middle cut, medium, and then a lighter. And then it gets even lighter with this seafoam green. Oh, I love it. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. These are going to be fun. It won't take me long to get these done. So, But with this craze of the Mandalorian, I'm telling you, people, everybody loves the Mandalorian. And they're watching that WandaVision too now. Um, they're liking that WandaVision. So I'm wondering if I should look up some WandaVision ones. I think I thought this a little bit too out of whack, but it'll be okay. 
A lot of people out there love the Avengers, love the superheroes, love Wonder Woman. We love Wonder Woman. Um, if I should show y'all some superheroes, let me know what superheroes y'all like. Do you like watching WandaVision? It was kind of, it was very different. You had to, now look, if you've started WandaVision and you ain't got past the first one, because it is kind of strange, <laughs> You're like, what in the world are they doing with this? It, by, get to the third one. Watch till the thir end of the third one, fourth one. You will understand that it, a little by little, um, reveals itself. So, I got something in my eye. Uh, and no, it's not my eyeball, youngins. I, one of you had to have said it. <laughs> Make sure that these are the right ones. B1236, this is 30 by 40. Again, we have this. And we have the other one. This come in a set. Let me see if I can get both of these together. Under there like this. Do you think that'll work? Yeah, I think that'll work. Got a little bit of a glare. It's gonna work, youngins, I think. There we go. I hope you love these just as much as I do. I'm probably just gonna put them out in something to get flattened and put these in another thing. So, there you go. This is the Mandalorian Grogu, the little child, the child, or whatever they call it. If you've watched the Mandalorian, let me know how you felt about it. If you liked it and it had a good, good theme. To me, I liked it, but when he took his helmet off the first time, or was I disappointed? I thought this guy was going to be like the 300, you know, the guy that played in 300 or something. I don't know. There's just, when there's nothing wrong with that actor. It just, for some reason, his voice and the, the persona of the Mandalorian just doesn't match the actor presence after, when he takes that helmet off. It just doesn't, I don't know. Does that, is that how you feel too about it? Could you see somebody else being the Mandalorian? Did you have any other issues? They fired the girl after one of her tweets of an opinion that she had said, which wasn't that bad of an opinion, but they fired her because of pressure from other people. That's so sad. She was good. I liked her. So I wish her well. I hope she goes on and does some great things because, you know, that wasn't right. But anyways, that's just my opinion. If y'all are glad she's gone, you can give a thumbs up or a thumbs down or whatever, but I hope you give me a thumbs up. Subscribe and hit that like button. Please let me know how you like it. If you, if you see something, if you have a certain favorite, like a, a movie or anything that may be in diamond painting, let me know. I'll see if I can't find them somewhere on Amazon or AliExpress. So you have a good rest of your week. I'm going to get in here and start organizing a little better than what I've got. And you can see my storage ideas in the description below. The link to that video will be down there. I hope y'all loved these Mandalorian pictures. Bye. <music>